And got swarmed. The three from Thompson. And it's cool. Dallas, no good that time either. Here's Ante Tacumbo. And the slam dunk by Ante Tacumbo. What's good, YouTube, man? Today, man, we back with another 2K24 video, man. This might be the one of the most craziest, craziest 2K24 videos I've made yet, bro. Because this video right here about to really make y'all boys lock in, bro. But look. Before we get any farther into the video, man, I get to showing y'all all the information and everything that's going on with 2K24 right now. Make sure y'all hit that like button. Send it to y'all friends. If you know your friend's a dribble guy or a dribbler, y'all know I'm here for the dribbling, bro. Like, that's the main thing I'm here for, y'all. I got some good news, y'all. Dribbling is back, man. So before we get into anything, smash that subscribe button, bro. Do not watch this video without smashing that subscribe button, bro, because we on the road. We on the road to one point zero eight k actually we have to be on the road to 1.1k so make sure y'all get me to 1.1k man we at 1.07k bro so all i need is man 30 of y'all man to hit that subscribe button man, and watch this video jump right into it man okay all right y'all we back man as you can see man, we got 2k24 up here up here on the screen man now this is verified 2k24 gameplay as y'all can see it up at the top break your ankles in green Greening smother shots in 2K24 early release gameplay, y'all. This is quick game. This is not my part, but you know if you good at dribbling, man, you know you can get on quick game, bro, and do the same thing you can do in the part, depending on if the characters have the seeds that you use. My fault. Depending on if the characters have the seeds that you use. It. So obviously, man, y'all probably already seen this video. Y'all probably know who I'm watching, man. I'm watching Cheezo Holic, man. The reason why I'm watching Cheezo Holic, man, because everybody who went to the community day, I think Cheezo Holic is the best comp dribbler or iso player there uh when it come to like um real like combo in the ball like it's probably a lot of them who can't really do misdirection and standing snatchbacks and make it look clean so we watch a cheese the holic video as y'all can see so let's get right into it man off the rip um let's go ahead and push play man my comp guards man y'all gonna love this man look look what he's doing with trey young y'all look what he's doing with trey young you use no drilling bars you use no you use you lose no adrenaline bars, y'all. Y'all see how he's just misdirection the best out of this AI, bro. 2K24 is going to be tough. Mixed with all the speed boosts. I'm going to show all the speed boosts up here on the screen a um, little bit later in the video. Right now, we're going to finish watching everything he's doing with the um, you know, with the quick game, y'all. But I think, bro, it's about to be crazy, y'all. Like, I'm not going to tell y'all what I'm making, bro, but I'm coming heat, y'all. I'm coming heat. I might surprise a lot of y'all with these builds, man. But comp guards... Is for sure back, man. Comp stage might be back, man, because I feel like comp guard is, is like, you know, being able to dribble as a guard is really, really good. So hopefully they balance the game out with the lockdowns. I don't want y'all to think like I just want dribbling just be OP. Even though y'all dribbling is OP, I promise y'all, once y'all see the speed boost moves that you can do as different characters, I'm going to show the speed boost um, animations um a little bit later in the video. I'm going to put them up here on the screen. But... Man, look at this, man. Look look how he's dribbling with this, bro. And you and you lose you lose no stamina, y'all. I mean you lose you lose no adrenaline bars just dribbling instead of still. You don't even use adrenaline bars if you speed boost. And let me tell y'all something, right? We all know quick game is always slower than my part, bro. My opinion, when I play quick game, it's always a slower pace than it is in the my park and online. Like I feel like if you take a a six nine, right? If you take a 6-9 and play with him in the park on 2K23 or a 6-8 or a 6-7, right? Then you go and grab KD or LeBron in a quick game. For some reason, your mod player always move faster than the characters in quick game. So, imagine how people would be dribbling, man, in the park with all this, man. Look at this. Curry slide is confirmed back in the game, y'all. Curry slide is back in the game, bro. Curry slide is back from 20. Yes. He's spamming the curry slide right now, y'all. I don't know if y'all can see it with my camera in a way, but... 
he's spamming the curry slide. Like he's uh spamming the curry slide. Curry slide is back in the game, man. W Cheese the Hall. I feel like Cheese the Hall is, is the perfect guy to um for 2K to bring up there, man. And really, you know, let us know what's going on with the dribbling, man. A lot of y'all probably haven't seen this game because y'all probably not that deep into K to in 2K to know who Cheeseaholic is. Like y'all probably know him because y'all seen him before, but y'all probably don't like really know like what he possibly could do. Like he probably uh, at the at the 2K you know community day, he probably one of the best dribblers up there. So W Cheeseaholic Curry shot look a little bit different though. Curry shot look different. So I, I'm let me tell you another thing I'm excited for with 2K24. All the old jump shots. It's about to be a whole new set of jump shots due to pro play. Pro play really about to change the game. Everybody jump shot is basically how it is in real life. I feel like the old jump shots that we used to have was uh it, it well, well I know that it was mo capped. All the other jump shots was mo capped. So peep this, y'all. Peep, peep how saucy this get right here. Peep how saucy this get. It looked like it's supposed to be the crab animation, but it like they changed it because of pro play. But it still looked like the crab animation. That still looked like the crab animation, you know? That still looked like the crab animation. Look, that looks kind of like the crab animation. Right there? That kind of looks like the crab animation a little bit. Curry might not be the wave, though. Like, if, if, if Curry is a, is a all, like, you use an all Curry six, it might not be the wave. But he, he getting, yeah, he getting saucy with it, though. He getting saucy with it. Y'all know who I'm excited to see play this game. I'm excited to see how uh, <laughs> Steve's open finna do with the pro play. Pro play finna make this game crazy, y'all. But dribbling, dribbling is for short back. You don't use stamina. You don't lose stamina for that. Um, you don't. You don't lose stamina for uh for dribbling now. Um, I got some more stuff to talk to over it too. We're just looking at the game play right now. Let's see what he can do with Fisher. Dribbling might it might take us a minute to really get the seeds down packed though, yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I feel like once soon I feel like bro, I ain't gonna cap the I feel like as soon as I touch down with that with that with that build that I'm coming, man. Make sure y'all hit that last subscribe button, man, so y'all can see what I'm coming, man. Y'all gotta see what I'm finna be coming, man, for this 2K24, bro. Y'all gonna want this build, bro. I'm trying to tell y'all. I'm already seeing what's finna be meta, bro. I'm already knowing what's finna be meta, bro. It like they got a little rhythm dribble on there though. All right, we back, man. I'm, I had to move my camera, man, so we could uh, go over this right here, man. This is all the caps that you need for uh, playmaking. Um, we got playmaking, shooting, the defense, and I think it's one more thing up here. But we're going to go through all these and see exactly what we need for what. So we could go into 2K24 knowing what's already going on, bro. So you wouldn't be confused. You feel what I'm saying? So if you, you pop it out, man, I mean, I'm helping y'all out, man. Make sure I hit that subscribe button, man. Don't, you feel what I'm saying? Don't, don't miss out on nothing, bro. But. Um, six ten for the max height. Max height six ten. For um, I don't know if this for all these right here for the max height to get all these passing, these passing badges. But I'm gonna tell you exactly what we gonna need to do off the rip. I'm already knowing what's meta off the rip, y'all. Uh, I already know how this gonna go, bro. All right, man. All right, all right. Let, let's look at this. Let's look at this, bro. Max height six ten, bro. If you want ball out, if you want ball out, you gotta have an 80. Well, y'all, I think y'all can see this. If y'all can't, I'm gonna just talk through them anyways. If y'all can't see it, but y'all can y'all can see where my mouse at, right? So for ball out, for the ball out badge, for bronze, you gotta have an 80, 87 pass accuracy. Silver, you gotta have a 91. Gold, you gotta have a 95. And Hall of Fame for a 99. Uh, break starter. Y'all already know what break starter is. Uh, I don't know if y'all can see this, but for Hall of Fame break starter, bro, you gotta have a 92. For gold, you gotta have an 86, and for silver, you gotta have a 75. Uh, for dimer, for dimer Hall of Fame, you gotta have a 96. For gold, you gotta have an 82, uh, 80, uh, 89, and for silver, you gotta have a 73. Needle threader, for needle threader, I love needle threader, y'all. Like I ain't gonna, lie. I, I, I go needle threader over any badge just so you could get the pass through. Like, you know what I'm saying? But for needle threader, man, at least silver, you gotta have an 84. For for it to be gold, you gotta have a 91. For uh, Hall of Fame, you gotta have a 98. Uh, post playmaker, I really don't care about post playmaker. That's not gonna be my style of play. But for post playmaker, you gotta the max height is gonna be six six. 
uh, that's probably for all these badges under here. Like, you gotta have a, like, basically, if you 6'6 six, six and higher, you probably won't be able to get, um, you might won't be able to get relay pass or special delivery and touch passer and post playmaker if, you, if you're taller than 6'6. Six, six. Because it's a minimum height 6'6. Six, six. So I'm guessing that's the minimum you could be is 6'6. Six, six. And the max height you could be for these is 6'10. If you anything over 6'10, you might not be able to get break starter, dimer, needle threader, and stuff like that if you're anything over 6'10. Or if you do, it might not be able to get like Hall of Fame or something like that. I don't know. We're going to see. But, um,. Uh, relay passer, you gotta have a 60 pass for it to be bronze, you gotta have a 70, a 76 for it to be silver, you gotta have a, um, a 98 for it to be gold, you gotta have Hall of Fame for it, for it to be a 95. Uh, special delivery pass, you gotta have a 69 for it to be bronze, if for silver, it gotta be a 75, for gold, it gotta be an 83, for Hall of Fame, it gotta be a 91. Touch pass, y'all. I'm hearing touch pass is an OP badge, y'all. Like, I'm hearing touch pass is an OP badge. You hear this from me now. So, if you watch this video, when touch pass be like, everybody be like, yeah, touch pass go crazy. Remember, like, yeah, trends did say that, bro. Touch pass is going to be crazy, y'all. You got for it to be Hall of Fame, you got to have a 95 for it to be gold. You got to have a 90 for it to be silver. You got to have an 82 for it to be bronze. You got to have a 74. Now, this is, um, the pars of the, the the things that I was really into, man. The ball handling. I'm really ready to see maximum height six nine. Okay, <laughs> max height six nine, bro. Max height six nine for these right here. For ankle breaker, you gotta have a 93 ball handler for it to be Hall of Fame. For ankle breaker, 85 for it to be gold. 75 for it to be uh silver, and 62 for it to be 62 for it to be bronze. Big drive. Big drive. Um, this is kind of weird to read, but it say you gotta have two things, three things at once, three things at once in order to get Big Driver Hall of Fame. You gotta have a 69 ball handling and a 65 speed with ball and a 60 acceleration and on down. If y'all can see all these others on the list, um, blow by. <laughs> Hey, hey, though, you, the max height for blow by is literally 6'11, bro. You could be 6'11, bro, and get blow bys, bro. <laughs> Giannis, huh? Okay, uh, you gotta have a 95 ball handling and a 98 speed with ball and a 90 acceleration to get that. You gotta have a 90, y'all. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. Nigga, yeah, I ain't gonna. I ain't watch my language. People is gonna be out here with a 610, 611, bro. I'm trying to tell y'all. They finna be out, out here blowing past you, bro. With bully, blow by, and big driver. I'm trying to tell y'all now. I'm trying to tell y'all now. Um uh you gotta have a 90, you gotta have a 97, and you gotta have an eight. I mean you gotta have a 97 ball handle. Bro, you can get that at Hall of Fame? Okay, alright. Um, alright. 97 ball handling, 89 speed with ball, 90 acceleration. Uh max height for handles for days is seven feet. Um You got you gotta have a ninety you gotta have a ninety-five and you gotta have a ninety-nine stamina. So now it's this and this to get more badges. Usually it just was you just had to handle like your ball handling up, and you get to get there. But now you gotta have your stamina up. So, uh, 95 ball handling, 90, uh, 99 stamina, 96 stamina, and 91 ball control for gold. Um, I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I'm going for that gold or Hall of Fame off the rip, bro. I'm not gonna lie to y'all, bro. Um, hyperdrive, got a little hyperdrive, y'all. We coming 90. You got. I meant you gotta have a 91 Hall of Fame. Uh, speed with ball. A 91 for Hall of Fame, see what ball, and you got to have a 90 speed. If you don't got no 90 speed and a 91 uh, ball handling, you can't get it Hall of Fame. Gold, you got to have an 83 and an 82 speed. Silver, you got to have a 70, 75 and an 80 speed. And you all can see the bronze right there. Killer combo, to get it Hall of Fame, you got to have a 98. You got to have a 98 ball handling. You got to have a 93 for gold. 
then you gotta have an 87, an 87 for silver. Mm. Uh, physical handles, you gotta have. Okay, I guess physical handles is like being able to like dribble the ball against your defender and push him out the way. I'm guessing that's what that is, cause this is you gotta to get that you gotta have that end strength up. So you gotta have an 80 ball handling with an 83 strength. You gotta have a 73 ball handling with a 73 strength. 66 with a six a 66 ball handling with a 63 strength to get physical handles. Uh, speed booster. Okay, speed booster is probably the best badge in the game that I have seen so far. Mixing that with blowbot and ha not handles for days necessarily, but mixing uh, speed booster and blowbot together is gonna be really crazy. Um, so for Hall of Fame, you gotta have and a max height of six nine. You gotta have um, a ninety four ball handling and a ninety one speed with ball and a ninety acceleration. I mean a ninety speed or acceleration. Uh huh. And then this is for gold and unpluckable. You gotta have a ninety eight for gold. I mean for Hall of Fame for gold. You gotta have an eighty or or a ninety two ball handling. So it's like you gotta have this or that. Okay. All right. Now this is for the shooting. Okay, this is for the shooting right here. This is per perimeter shooting. You got a uh, mini magician, agent threes, claymore, corner specials, limitless range, blinders, catch and shoot, comeback kid, dead eye, um, green machine, guard up, open looks, open. I mean, space creator, uh, spot finder, free th free points, and slippery off ball. Uh, for so far, I'm pretty sure if y'all not really tuned into 2K. Uh, news like that y'all just ready for the game to drop I'm here y'all watching me because y'all support me or y'all just do want to find out more about 2k um, I can tell y'all the three new badges up here is open looks spot spot finder and uh, Free points open line open looks is more Kind of I guess you could say it, it is you know what it what it looks like but spot finder and free points might be a little bit different because this might be a badge that you had to read to the description to know what's what's going on with these badges right here. So Spot Finder is more of like a um, a Curry style of play. Like it's more like a Curry style of play. When somebody send you an off ball screen, you can find your spot, shoot it. You know, it's like an off ball shot. Like you know, off ball shot. Not for off ball shot. That's what that is. And free points is the James Harden. If y'all don't know, now you know. It's the James Harden. Uh, shooting the ball and getting contested and you get you know free buckets for shooting the three yeah I believe that that's what it is I think when you shoot the three you get the and one call and you got to have a certain free throw for the free points I believe the free points is on um, it's a it's a perimeter it's perimeter shooting so once you shoot at the three you get a plus a and one so you got to have a certain free throw you know what I'm saying to hit that and one shot for the free points and open looks is probably like um, like being able to create your create your shot, kind of like Space Creator, but a little bit different. Like it's probably not like Space Creator, but it's kind of like um, like kind of like being able to fade behind a screen, something like that. It might be able to be able to fade behind a screen. That's what that might be. So I'm pretty sure y'all can see all these MIDI magician, everything you need for which one. I'm gonna leave this up here on the screen for y'all, just in case y'all need to look at it a little bit longer. Here y'all go. This is everything you need for everything, bro. But I'm gonna tell y'all the ones that I'm that I'm most likely gonna go with. Obviously, Claymore, Green Machine. Um, I think those is like the same things that you've been needed. Limitless range. Um, yeah, I think everything else is really the same. It's only these three new badges right here that I do see. But I know that there is more badges in other other columns like this. Inside scoring. Um, you got Acrobat, Fearless Finisher, Float Game, Giant Slayer, Pro Touch, Scooper, Posterizer, Position Dunker, Rise Up, uh, Aerial Wizard, Bunny, Fast Twitch, Slithery, Spin Cycle, Two Step, Bulldozer, Whistle, um, Back Down, Punisher, Dream Shake, Drop, Drop Stopper, uh, Post Spin Technician, Hook Specialist, and Fade Fen Fenon. So, Post fade phantom, my fault. Um, I really don't care about slap. I'm not gonna lie. I really don't care about dunking y'all. But when I do get to dunking y'all, the badge that I will be probably going with that I'm mostly playing to, to obviously, it's um. Well, they took limitless range out the game, so really it's position dunk and posterizer. I think them gonna be my main two dunk 
uh, badges that I look for, and maybe Bulldozer, but Bulldozer don't be kind of crazy. Bulldozer's an OP badge, y'all, in the game. Now, Bulldozer is very OP, so if you got a lot of strength, you're really going to be Bulldozer people out the way. But I know that's going to be a lot of sacrificing for other stuff. That's going to be like, when she, if you want Hall of Fame Bulldozer, it's going to be something your player going to lack it, going with that 96 strength. You know what I'm saying? So, but Bulldozer is an OP badge, especially if you, like, I don't know. Like, if you don't know how to get past your defender, I feel like Bulldozer is going to be like, um, Bulldozer, y'all, I'm going to tell you this now, y'all, Bulldozer is going to be worse than Limitless Takeoff. They should not put Bulldozer in the game, bro. Like, when I seen how Giannis was bulldozing people out the way, bro, in the quick matches, bro, bro, let me tell y'all, Bulldozer is just going to be just as OP as dunk sticking and just making the dunk every time, bro. Bulldozer is OP. Because you just bulldoze your teammate out the way. They, 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 I heard that they was nerfing a bad job, but that badge right there is looking crazy. Um, everything else really solid. Rise up. Everything else is solid, for real. Um, you know. Uh, screens, defense, and rebounding. So, um, let me see if they got anything new in here. They do. Uh, uh, the new badge that's in here is Fast Feet. Uh, 95, 94 feet, uh, Impovable Enforcer, Right Stick Ripper, ooh, that sound tough skis, Right Stick Ripper, ooh, that might be a center badge though, no, it might not be, that might just be for locks, Right Stick Ripper, that's tough, and on top of that, you got Glove and Right Stick Ripper, Interceptor, fast feet. Okay, fast feet. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah. Locks, locks might be OP this year, y'all. Locks might be OP. Locks might be OP. But now, um, I'm gonna switch the cam back, y'all. I'm gonna switch the cam back. Um, basically, what I'm gonna do, man, I'm gonna go in here and look at the videos that I do got. I'm gonna put them up here on the screen. If y'all haven't seen them. I'm going to put the videos up here on my screen somewhere. I'm going to put, put the videos up here on the screen, man, so y'all can see. Um, basically, what I was saying about, you know, basically what I was saying about, um, like, Giannis speed boosting at seven foot, just running down the court. He he hit down the court within two stripes. Two stripes, he was down the court, bro. Two stripes, he was down the court. You got uh, Mitchell doing his, you know, his speed boost. Uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be really it's gonna be a real uh you got the curry you got the curry up there man it's gonna be a real crazy game man I can't wait to see um how 2K gonna be looking for the year man I think it's gonna be a W game man um I'm excited to see what they gonna do with everything man with the city man it's gonna be a real crazy game um uh, honestly that's gonna be the end of the video man I appreciate y'all for coming out and supporting man so. Make sure y'all hit that like button, that subscribe button, man. I'm going to catch y'all boys in the next YouTube video, man. Let's go. My diamonds look like they came with some party lights.